hi everyone welcome again on my channel today we will see next topic in this video series that is stock transfer in sap mm so here we will see all the relevant activities about stock transfer and eventually we will dive just we will create background for stock transfer order in this video but we will see one step two step stock transfers between storage and plant even material to material or stock to stock so what is exactly stock transfer so stock transfer describes a process in warehouse or you can take a store for moving goods from one part of the distribution chain to the another or you can say from one part of storage to the another part of storage in general the stock transfer is aimed at the optimizing the storage capacity according to the certain strategies also it may be depend on the storage size or warehouse how we manage the stock internally or even externally while uh, giving it to the customers or share giving it to the another plant or storage location so stock transfer is nothing but in nutshell just movement of stock from one place to another place it might be in terms of material it might be in terms of physical movement it might be just movement in system so what all types of stock transfer is there so we will see that in a brief so stock transfer there are transfer postings and there are physical stock transfer uh, available so we will see one by one each so first we will focus on transfer posting of stock transfer so what this means to change the stock type or material number in case of material to material transfer or any additional physical movement like consignment to warehouse or uh, subcontracting stock to vendor stock or like that then there is another physical movement of stock there so this is the physical stock transfer so in that what happened exactly physical material movement so that might be from one storage location to another storage location that might be from one plant to the another plant of same company code or one plant to the another plant of different company code again that will be in one step so one step from one stock uh, storage location to another storage location or in two step from one storage location to another storage location and same one step and two step for plant to plant transfer and again there is again another way to transfer stock that is sto stock transfer order with uh, proper purchase order with the document type stock transfer order there is a facility where we can transfer stock from one plant to an another plant of same company code or cross company code so we'll see everything today we will cover uh, except sto we will cover rest of all things in this video and we will give some background for sto as well why we need sto and all that so what is stock to stock transfer so in stock to stock transfer once you receive goods in your environment then you move that stock in between these three from unrestricted use to the quality inspection and block stock so depending on organization it varies sometimes there is a necessity where you need to do a quality inspection of stock then you, where you check certain number of quality or audit for the material that you received and depending on that quality check you decide whether this stock is appropriate for use or not if it is not used then you can place that stock in blocked stock or sometime if you receive stock and uh, whomsoever is receiving that stock identified that this stock is uh, damaged or not usable or not up to the extent of in terms of quality then you might put in block stock and after checking you may decide certain quantity return to vendor or certain you may put uh, in unrestricted to use in that so we will see this in uh, a real example in system so we will go in system and we will see how stock to stock transfer happens and it happens in between storage so we can move stock in these three areas of same storage so let's see how we can do in system so once you go in system go into t code mego so once you go in mego you have to change here stock transfer 
but before that i have to create stock for particular material so what i can do i will create manually stock for particular material so also i will open another window with mmb so where we can check directly stock availability so i have created material i will select that material so i have created this material then i will see whether i have any stock for this material so as of now for this material i don't have any stock so we will create initial stock for this material so i will go in another window where i will create initial stock for this material through movement type 561 or i can do another way as well so where i can create a purchase order and i can do goods receipt but uh, as i am testing i will do a sh uh, follow shortcut and i will directly create uh, initial stock for this uh, material so i will upload initial stock 561 okay 561 is not planned for this okay goods issue then 561 then let's say i will create 100 quantity of this material so we can play around for this material and then i will provide material here that i have created okay not this one so i have created this material i will use this material okay then how much quantity so i will create initial stock of 100 then where i wanted it so i will use standard plant triple zero one and storage location also triple zero one an item okay and i can save this so what i did i have created initial stock for this material so i can go in mmb and now i can check i have initial stock or not so i have initial stock in unrestricted use let's say now i wanted to move this initial stock so i have in an unrestricted use under storage location triple zero one in my case so let's say i have identified that this stock needs some quality inspection so how i can move this stock from unrestricted use into the quality inspection so there is a movement type 3 to 2 movement i can use to move this stock from quality inspection uh, sorry from unrestricted use to the quality inspection or i have alternative i can move direct stock to stock from unrestricted to block stock using 344 movement so we will see both now 322 and 344 so let's go into system okay so here i will change now to transfer posting go into migo change transfer posting other and we have movement type 322 where we can move stock from unrestricted use to the quality inspection so if i go in this so i can see i have no other stock in mmb i have only stock in unrestricted use so let's consider case uh, you received stock and now you identified some issue with stock and you wanted to do a quality inspection for this stock so how we can do so use movement type 322 then provide which material you wanted to do this move then give which plant so you can give plant then which storage location so i'm using 100 sorry triple zero one then material i have already given then how much quantity you wanted to move so i have 100 quantity let's say i will do it for 20 quantity with 3 to 2 movement and i am going to move this stock from so movement type it self says we will check movement as well so it's three to two movement so where we can do transfer posting from quality in a, uh, in a quality inspection to unrestricted and reverse also actually we are moving from unrestricted to quality inspection this talk so yeah i will do that so once everything is checked you think everything is okay just take this and post or save so i will save this document so it is posted now if i go in mmb and just refresh this so we can see now this stock get distributed from unrestricted now i have moved 20 stock into quality inspection 
let's say still I identified out of this 80 10 is a damage stock so I should move that in block stock to take further action so let's see how we can do that so there is movement type as I said 5 uh, 3 4 4 where we can move stock from unrestricted to block stock and then again same material then plant storage location then how much quantity let's say I identified 10 quantity that need to be moved in block stock then same material quantity I have already given and this will be the my destination then ok and post so again go in MMB so as of now there is no block stock if I check here there is no block stock at all ok so I will just refresh this so this will change so now here we have 70 and there must be 10 stock in blocked stock so this block means we cannot use this stock anywhere further action or check required on this then so we have seen 344 and 322 movement type so we have moved stock from unrestricted to quality or blocked stock how we can move now we will see how we can move quality stock either to block or unrestricted so if you wanted to move quality inspection stock let's say in while quality analysis or quality inspection I have identified there are uh, four or five product are defective or not up to the quality that we required or maybe damaged then we can move that stock to block stock and later we can return that to vendor or further action we can take accordingly so how we can do that so with 350 or after quality inspection let's say you identified that lot is clear to use then we can move from quality inspection to unrestricted stock with 321 so let's see 350 and 321 how we can move this stock internally in storage location so as of now we have stock here 10 in block in quality inspection we have 20 20 so let's say i will move 5 into block stock and uh, 5 into unrestricted use so let's see how we can do so movement type to move from quality inspection to block stock is 350 if you don't uh, if you don't know movement you can go here and you can search as well so if i check here 350 is block stock to quality inspection stock but it's a reversal so quality inspection stock to block stock okay then what is my material then which plant it belong to and which storage location then just check all the yeah how much quantity so i decided five is faulty and partner not required then once you have given everything you can perform 350 but here I will add another line item as well and I will perform uh, both movements in same time so here um, I will do 321 as well in that I will move from quality to unrestricted 5 quantity so I am doing 2 uh, postings in the same transfer posting then 5 so what will happen now I have 20 here but out of this 20 I am moving 5 in unrestricted use and 5 in block stock so this will be 15 and this will be 75 so let's see ok I have maintained everything here ok yeah everything is updated okay line item 2 now line item 1 yeah, this is the line item 1 everything is okay so line item 1 is with 350 movement type and line item 2 is with 321 so we are moving from quality to unrestricted and from quality to block stock because it's a reversal so just post or save it okay now I have done this posting as well so let's check stock so as of now I haven't refreshed so it's same but let's see I will do a refresh
okay now it's in single screen so we can see better so just we'll refresh it okay so now it's 75 and this block stock is also 15 so this way we can move from quality inspection to either unrestricted or block stock with 321 or 350 now we will see how we can move from block stock to either unrestricted or quality inspection so two movement type are are there we can move from block stock with 343 or 349 these two movement internally so let's see we will do the same so we will check how much block stock we have now so we have 15 block stock out of that i will move let's say six into the unrestricted and six into the quality inspection so if I add 6 to this, it will be 81 and this will be 16. So let's do it. So here I have movement type. It will be same transfer posting others. Then movement type will be five, uh, 349. So 349 here will be for block stock to quality inspection stock. So I'm moving from block to quality inspection. Then plant storage location. Then how much? So I said six, I will utilize here. So everything is clear. Then another, I will add next line item in same one. That will be my 343 so what will happen there with 343 so in 343 i am transferring stock from block to unrestricted so again here i will also use six and then six quantity here okay so now what we are looking for so we are transferring from blocked stock to quality inspection and unrestricted use with 349 and 343 so these are really important movement types and we must know how we do transfer stock to stock then i will post this document okay let's check whether it uh, succeed or not so i have year 75 and i have transfer 6 and here I have 10 so it should get updated 81 and 16 after transferring from block stock to quality inspection so it got updated accordingly and same quantity got reduced from this now we have only three in block stock so this is how we do stock to stock transfer internally in storage location depending on the, our requirement and the type of stock and also what we require so sometime uh, industries like chemical industry or medical pharma they need some quality assurance even in electronic industry whether whenever you receive stock out of that certain number of percentage stock should be checked for its quality whether that quality of the stock is appropriate or not if it is a degraded then the whatever we decide then we can put it in block stock and then we return to vendor or depending action we take we may ask for replacement or we may uh, ask for credit or debit note or whatever is appropriate there accordingly so this is a stock to stock transfer then what we have seen stock to stock now we will see material to material stock transfer so what happened in material to material transfer but before going into the material to material transfer why we required material to material stock transfer so uh, let's say we have material where we need uh, that material so material property get changed over the period let's say now you um, have milk so you bought milk and you put for some fermentation process and then out of that milk you will create another product maybe yogurt or paneer like that or let's say you have old wine and new wine so let's say you created new wine now and over the period of one year that will turn into the old wine and it will have different value or there may be cheese example so new cheese and old cheese so depending on material properties over the period of time it changes 
at that point we need to transfer that material to material but there are some condition we cannot plan this material to material type posting with reservation also the posting can be made only from the unrestricted use to unrestricted use so in last one we have seen how we transfer in between unrestricted quality inspection and block stock but while transferring from material to material there is a condition it should be from unrestricted to unrestricted use then posting can be entered in system with a transaction MIGO or we can use Fury as well for good posting that's fine then posting can be made in only single step so further in this video we will see one step and two step stock transfer but here we while transferring from material to material there is no two step way and most important while transferring from material to material the unit of measure or the measurement unit of that particular material must have same for both material masters so that's the one requirement here so we will see material to material transfer so see here is example how we transfer that material to material and here are few example let's say you have new or young cheese and over the period of time let's say few months or year it will transfer into the old cheese then it will have greater value then same in uh, in terms of wine so older the wine is expensive so let's say today you created some wine so let's say for one year it will be new wine then uh, two year it will be old wine and it will be expensive so it need to transfer to the different material or if oh, let's say 10 year old or 15 year old wine accordingly they will transfer into the appropriate material type so these are the few examples where we need to transfer from material to material so let's see we will do this uh, in system so again i have you created couple of material with same example so here i will use material old wine and new wine so let's see if i have stock for new wine so i have no stock what i will do i will upload initial stock again with 561 as we did in last example so here it will be goods issue and again 561 and let's say i will create here stock for new wine with 10 or maybe 20 quantity for example then where so i will create it in this storage location and plan okay so save now again i will check in mmb so mmb is very important here where we can check stock details so now i have created 20 stock let's say now i wanted to move it to the old wine so i will show you here i don't have old wine stock as of now sorry i guess i have to go back and update it it will not take here okay so for old wine there is no stock as of now so what we will do we will go in system and we will perform transfer posting for new to old wine so let's consider that old uh, new wine now became old wine over the period and its property got changed over the period and it will be expensive wine so we have movement type 309 as we have seen here example and also note that as i said base unit of major must be same while transferring from one material to another material so we will perform same go into system now check here for movement type and see here 309 where we can see transfer posting from material to material then provide that material so in my case i have new wine as my material then my plant is this storage location is this and my destination material will be old wine and plant and material plant and storage location will be the same okay then how much quantity so let's say 15 only out of 20 i am transferring now okay yeah so just check if there is any issue no just post this document okay now i can go in mmb and i can check so now as of now for old wine there is no stock so if i refresh i can see now 15 is updated but note here it's not updated 
in any storage location it is just material property got changed so i moved from one material to another material so if i talk in sap system perspective so we have changed the material number to the different material number so we have moved stock from one material number to another material number so it's material to material transfer and same i will check for new wine so there should be less stock now so we have moved 15 so 5 will be there so see here so this is material to material transfer then what is one step and two step stock transfer so we will see that and how it is useful so let's say the here uh, issuing organization that might be plant or storage location but there are two ways where we can transfer stock from one uh, issuing organization to the another receiving organization in two step and one step so one step means you will remove it from here and you will directly put in another stock if it is a two step then in one moment type we will remove from this store uh, storage location or plant then it will be in transit and in second uh, moment type you gonna place that in appropriate stock or plant wherever you want it to so there is two type one step and two step one step means only one moment will be there it will finish your work but if it is a two step then one moment you will remove and in second moment it will get placed into the appropriate location that might be storage or plant so this is how it work one step and two step then we will see storage location to storage location stock transfer in one step so there is a storage location to storage location transfer but for that we must have that material extended to the storage location so what i will do i will extend my material to the storage location so i have this material mm01 so this is the my material here i will extend it to the different storage location okay which storage location is there okay uh, i will use rmsl okay okay so it is under same plan but i have extended to the different storage location so now we will see that yeah so from this will be under the same plant but from one storage location to the another storage location of same plant so we can move this material from one storage location to another storage location again in these three respective stocks so you can move from unrestricted stock to the unrestricted stock from quality to quality or from block to block or you can move from in quality to unrestricted or block to quality inspection and then if you wanted to move it in any other you can use the other stock transfer movement that we have seen while moving stock to stock transfer so we will see that all this one step movement so we'll start with 311 so i will go into system now i will again see i will run mmb and i will check stock here so I have stock 81 in unrestricted and I wanted to move that to here it is in triple zero one and I wanted to move in RMSL. So again go into T code MIGO and select transfer posting but here now you will see select moment 311 or you can go inside and you can check also what is a 311 moment type here transfer posting storage location in one step so here then press enter then which material you wanted to transfer so this material then which is your plant this plant then this then plant will be the same here but you have to select different storage location then check how much quantity so i have 81 let's say i am moving 11 quantities now and this rest of details then 
everything is okay check and save so i will save directly so now see now if i go here in mmb and check for this material so now it will get updated for another storage location as well so see now under this plant we have moved stock to this rmsl under unrestricted then next we have we can move from quality inspection to quality inspection with 323 so it will be the same just moment type will change 323 where we are moving stock from quality inspection to quality inspection so this is the one and other one also we can move stock from quality inspection to unrestricted use so for that movement type is 321 so again material it will be the same then quantity let's say i am selecting here 5 and now which plant so this will be the plant what storage location so i am moving for rmsl from triple zero one so i am moving from this to this but my movement type is three twenty one must be here because I am moving from quality to unrestricted use. So if I go here and I check here, yeah, here itself you can see from quality to unrestricted and at item one i am moving from quality to quality in that plant so i will save it okay Okay, so here uh, now I'm transferring um, from quality inspection to quality of other storage location and also to quality of uh, also unrestricted stock of other storage location. So if I'm transferring from quality to quality of other storage location, in this case, this material I am transferring from triple zero one storage location to the rmsl of other storage location one quantity here with movement type 321 that is quality to quality in same plant but different storage location and then in second one what i am doing i am transferring from quality to unrestricted so i will check this so everything is okay and quantity is one one for both cases I have added third line item that is not required. Okay, so I have posted this. Then you will check in MMB. So now here we have moved from quality inspection to the unrestricted and from quality to quality. So here we will get updated stock in RMSL for unrestricted as well as in quality. So I'll just refresh it. So here it got updated but why it's not got updated in quality let me check it should get updated so let's see what went wrong so i will do again quality to quality for uh, with 323 movement type something must be went wrong but i will check what went wrong so this is the plant this is the giver uh, giving storage location and this is the receiving storage location then how much quantity let's say two material is there two quantity yeah 323 so quality to quality in same plant let's see okay now it got posted so let's see here some quality to quality quantity should get updated 
yeah now it is updated maybe i have done something wrong in last one so we have moved from quality inspection to the unrestricted and quality to quality now we will move stock from block stock to the block stock of different storage location so in our case triple zero one two rmsl and also from block to quality inspection so movement types are 325 and 349 so let's do it so what we are gonna do now we gonna move this three block stock from this storage to the this storage in quality and block so let's do it so here movement type is 325 initially or if you are confused you can go here and you can check what is 325 so 325 we are moving block stock to block stock within a plant but different storage location so 325 and material will be this then this is the plant this is the sending storage location and this will be the receiving storage location so be careful while mm, selecting from and destination then quality so i have only three so i will take an example of only one and save it so now i have moved with 325 so here from block to block so from triple zero one to rmsl in block to block stock so let's check in mmb so now we should have one here and it should get removed one from here mm, why it's not updating did i take that or what went wrong okay let me check this document why it's not taking so i have moved from this storage location to our msl one quantity with movement type 323 so i have done right thing but why it's not get it updated why it's not updated let's check again no it's not i don't know what went wrong let me try to post it again three twenty five then plant this storage location this then transfer posting this is my material and destination storage location will be rmsl quantity is one everything seems fine item is okay then post okay let's go in mmb and check again okay now it's done i don't know why, why system is behaving a bit strange but yeah now we can see with 325 i have moved from block to block stock now i will move again out of this two quantity one quantity using 349 movement type from block stock to quality inspection so what i will do i will use this moment from moving from block to quality inspection of another story location from triple zero one to rmsl so let's go and check so movement type is 349 so check here appropriate movement so 349 here transfer posting block stock to quality inspection stock then enter then what is my material so same material that i am using then plant then storage location then which will be the my destination storage location so this will be the case then one then check all tabs so everything is fine then tick and post so now i have moved from block stock to quality inspection of different storage location so with 
this from block to quality inspection so let's check in mmb so in block now i have two out of that one i have moved here in quality inspection so here so it will get 13 let's check why mm, it is not happening again this is strange or maybe i'm doing something wrong i don't know quantity one check okay okay let's check again in mmb god what went wrong again yeah it moved in quality inspection of rmsl so here here five it was four initially i believe but yeah it's moved from here so now here only one quantity so that one from triple zero one has been moved but i don't know why system behaving bit strange anyway i don't know what is wrong with system but this is the way we move this stocks with this movement type so you must know all this movement while moving stock from one storage location to another storage location then next is storage location to storage location stock transfer between sl to sl in two steps so let's see how it works so there is two movement type that is a three one three and three one five so what we will do we will move from unrestricted use to unrestricted use so see here there is no blocked stock to block or unrestricted uh, sorry quality to quality so while moving in two step we will have stock in unrestricted only so let's see we will take example of again triple zero one and rmsl so let's say here i have 70 stock out of this i will move 15 or 10 stock to this storage location and it will be only in unrestricted use so this 70 will get 60 and here it will be 22 so let's go in system again transfer posting other and then movement type will be here 313 so in first movement we will move just out of storage or out of plant so here 313 so in that we are removing from storage location and it is storage location to storage location stock transfer then which is material then plant then sl then your destination sl storage location then how much quantity so i will use 10 here then material okay everything fine okay check post let me check in mmb so this should be 22 now and this will be 60 let's sorry this will be 60 but this will not be 22 it will show me see it is in transfer but it haven't received in storage location so this is still in transfer it haven't so it will be stuck in transfer but it's not get updated here so still it transfer mean it is in transit now let's say i received that stock and i will update in i will put that in storage location so again go into system and there is next movement type that is 315 so if we go here we can see in 315 we can put the from this transfer to in proper storage location so 315 will be the movement type where you put stock from transfer to storage location and check all details so i selected here example of 10 so everything is fine okay check
okay why this is come oh i have done mistake the storage location now will be rmsl only because i will tell you if i go here in mmb i can see this stock now in transit but under this rmsl so we should provide rmsl here and only rmsl because now we are putting in transit stock of rmsl into the unrestricted stock of rmsl so just save it okay so now this in transit stock will get added here so it will get 22 so let's see you see now in transit stock has been moved so there is no in transit stock now so that is two step sl to sl stock transfer then we will see next so we have finished with all the stock transfer between storage location where there is one step two step and again in from unrestricted to unrestricted and a quality to uh, quality or block to block or cross in between quality block and unrestricted so let's see now stock transfer between plant so again like storage location there is a processor of one step procedure two step procedure while moving stock between plants then there is a different way where we can move stock using stock transfer order without delivery only possible in two step then another one is stock transfer order via shipping possible within one or two step procedure also within with with the billing document so these are the various type where we can move stock between plants and also using this stock transfer order we can move stock in cross company means the plants of two different company code so this is the detail where with the stock transfer between two plants we can okay i will just make it bit bigger yeah so we can move from one plant to the plant two of same company code or we can move from plant one to the plant three of different company code and there will be three ways where we can move stock in between plants that is one step two step and stock transfer order with or without delivery so stock transfer between plants so this is the detail where uh, this is all the way where we can transfer stock between plants so it will show you there are two ways via an mm stock transfer posting so with st stock transfer posting we can move stock between plants that is one step and two step then another way is stock transfer through stock transfer order we can move stock in between so again that stock transfer order get divided into three part that is without logistic execution outbound delivery that is normally with simple movement type that is 351 i guess and then there is a mmsd integration where we move stock from one plant to another plant with logistic execution in a same company code where we say intra company code and another one is in two different company code or two plants of different company code that we say through sd with billing documents so these three are major stock transfer order type but that we will see in next video but we will cover now only stock transfer order in one or two step within a plant through movement types so let's see the two uh, how we can move stock between two plant of same company code just using stock transfer so we will see one by one first is one and two step so these are the details where we can move stock in from one plant to another plant so movement type is 303 and 305 if we are moving in two step and if we are moving in single step then it will be 301 so let's see in system so i have created this material and i have maintained this material for triple zero two storage location as well so let's see if we can move this stock with movement type first we will see 
single movement type that is 301 so i am moving stock from one plant to another plant so this is the my material my plant is triple zero one my storage location is triple zero one then my next plant is triple zero two and storage location will be triple zero one then how much quantity so let's check how much quantity i have here in unrestricted 60 so let's say i will move 20 so let's say 20 quantity here then check everything so everything is fine check and save okay so it's posted now check in mmb so one more plant will get add here if i refresh this so see now i have moved under same company code 20 quantity here so this is the one step and again we can do two step as i shown in for stock transfer order in two step for storage location with 303 and 305 but that you can do it's not that hard it's pretty easy then types of stock transfer so here why i'm giving this so we will check what we have covered so far and what we need to cover in next so but yeah here for consignment to warehouse that we have already covered in vendor consignment topic where we use for 411k movement type and how we take that consignment stock into warehouse stock then we have seen subcontracting stock how we give subcontracting stock with 541 movement type to the vendor and how it get returned with 543 movement so that another movement type that i am not covering because those topics are already covered if you want to check you can check those two topic in playlist so we have finished talk to stock transport where we have checked uh, unrestricted quality inspection and block stock and how we move that from one to another then we have seen material to material stock transfer where we moved stock from new wine to the old wine then also consignment and warehouse example i have just explained where you can check those videos stock transfer order uh, for cons uh, sorry you can check video for consignment and you can check video for vendor uh, vendor subcontract and vendor consignment then this transfer posting topic is over then also we checked storage location to storage location stock transfer in one and two step and we also checked partially plant to plant uh, with one and two step movement so now in next videos we will cover plant to plant stock transfer within a same company using sto that is stock transfer order and cross plant stock transfer order with or without delivery so this three topic i will cover in next video as a stock transfer or a stock transfer order so what we have seen today so we have seen stock to stock transfer then material to material transfer then consignment or subcon for that you can check video i haven't covered because it's already covered in other videos then storage location to storage location transfer with the help of one or two step movements and again plant to plant with one or two step and next i will cover stock transfer orders in this series so thank you for watching this video and also don't forget to subscribe and share this video with your friends and colleagues thank you see you in the next video bye